Hello everyone, my name is Stanley St. Rose, and today we're going to be talking about the CIA. Now, before I go into this topic, please remember to leave a like, subscribe, and or comment so that the channel can continue to grow. So, the CIA, what do they do? What, what are they all about? So, the CIA is the Central Intelligence Agency. Uh, this is a federal government agency. Uh, it works for the federal government. Basically, what they do is um, they collect information. They collect intelligence. Um, specifically, they collect information uh, from foreign government, foreign bodies. They're looking at terrorism. They're looking at um, different groups that could potentially hurt the United States um, or that can you know, hurt the United States at home. Um, they can conduct covert operations um, that involve submer subversion, assassination, uh, and sabotage. Um, they have agents that work overseas. They have people that collect over it, um, information through espionage. Um, so the CIA, uh, it's all very classified. Most of the things that they do, it's classified. It's a classified agency that most likely... Uh, in all instances, just pretty much work for the federal government. They're for the federal government, by the federal government. They collect information to, to mainly, their main focus is to create uh, reports, to analyze reports, uh, and to disseminate reports that help policymakers uh, make laws um, in the U.S. So, you know, think about the president, think about Congress, think about, you know, cabinets, uh, think about people in power in the United States. They need central intelligence. They need um, international intelligence. They need to know what's going on around the world. And they need it in a concise format uh, so they can make some policies that they can pass laws so that they can provide assistance uh, that, uh, that makes sense. And so you need an agency to collect that information, to process that information, to analyze that information, and disseminate it. Make sure that it gets to the right people uh, and make sure that, that, that you get the information that you need. Because the president will get briefed uh, and the CIA will provide them a whole host of different types of briefings and information about different countries, about different situations. Because, you know, the U.S. president, he is the U.S. president, but he also has to know what's going on around the world in different countries. Um, the relationship of, you know, of America with different countries and different governments uh, and he can't just do all that himself. He needs an agency to collect it, to process it, to analyze it, and, and, and make it in a concise format so that when he sits at his desk in the morning, he can get a briefing on what's going on, the most important things that are going around the world that he needs to uh, get involved with or, or you know, uh, use his power to solve or to, to you know, to make sure there's, a, there's something that gets done about it. Because the U.S. president... Uh, he's not just um, taking care of, of the homeland or just the U.S. Um, internally. He also has to uh, make sure that the U.S. is protected uh, internationally. So international relationships, international conflicts, international uh, interests, because, you know, the U.S. has a lot of interest and in investments uh, abroad. Uh, so it has to keep an ear, an eye um, on the world to make sure that its interests, uh, its investments, uh, its protections um, are well guarded. You can't just you know leave everything um, on the outside and just focus on the inside. So the CIA mainly focus uh, focuses on the foreign aspect of information gathering, what's going on on the outside. Um, not to get it confused with the NSA. The NSA is more more focused on um, you know gathering information from machines and communication ways. The CIA is mostly focused on what people know, information that people know, governments, um, individuals, groups, uh, what they're up to, what they're doing, what they're planning. Um, you know, for example, think about 9/11. The CIA's job would be to Get information way before 9/11 ever happened uh, to to prevent it from happening, to prevent it from hurting the U.S. Uh, but you know the the CIA was created in the 1940s, uh, but um, you know 9/11 was they they weren't able to stop that. Uh, but still, they do protect the U.S. Um, from a lot of threats, overseas threats, for um, international threats, foreign threats, terrorism threats. 
They're always collecting information. They're always conducting uh, operations, covert operations, and a lot of things that they do, it's, it's classified. Uh, and their main job is to provide information uh, to the president, to people in Congress, uh, to people in high power, um, to people in the federal government so that they can make uh, good policies and judgments and laws. Uh, they do several other things, but again, their main focus is information gathering uh, and, and being advisors, uh, an agency of advisors, of planners, uh, of um, um, for the president uh, and other governmental uh, leaders. Um, so that's the CIA. Uh, I mean, more, more people when it comes to society and the mainstream media, they usually paint the CIA as this top secret, um, you know, going in um, covert ops type of agency that's just killing all types of bad guys all over the world. Um, well, most of the information is classified, but from, from what we know, from what it was created to do, its main job is to collect information, brief the president, uh, and make sure that we have an eye on any potential threat uh, to the homeland, uh, to, um, to the United States in any way, shape, or form. Um, so that's the CIA, um, National Intelligence, um, no, no, the CIA, Central Intelligence Agency. I was thinking about the NSA for a minute there. So that's the CIA. Please remember to leave a like, subscribe, and or comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video.